Hi right, guys, this video is about make init CPIO. And if you want to know more, you are sent to the wiki, right? If you want to know your system, then Arch Linux is a great way of learning things. Arch Linux wiki make init CPIO. And you read. Okay. So that's one thing first. Do this first. Then continue the video with the following. In January 2022, we'll make a change. What change is that? We have a nice um, alias. This is an alias. N stands for nano. Nano make initcpo.io is actually opening a file in etc make initcpo.conf. So this file is a configuration file for the package make init CPO. Yeah, that's on the left there, which is a dependency of Linux package and so on. You keep on reading. The thing is, I've just made a video about VMD, which is nothing, that's not the topic of this video. The topic of the video is that we say in January, we're just not gonna do this anymore. So if you look at the system, the current system that you have, it's gonna say, compress it with XZ and now in January we'll just put the hashtag in front of there and then you'll say Eric but then there is no compression yes there is and it will be ZSTD so let's do the experiment if we do a control X and we say yes it is now without compression I mean by that I mean it's all hashtagged out which means it's going to be default ZSD saved and if you are creating all the files needed to boot up then it's gonna be around five seconds in my machine anyway that still depends on your hardware that is one thing five seconds if you go back and change it again to xset and save it run it again one two three Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, twenty, twenty five. Thirty-five, forty, forty-three. So, <laughs> join us in making the move as well. So Archlinx made a move already. We waited a bit because we need to be backwards compatible with kernels, and that's the problem, right? If you go, to, if you downgrade the kernel and you go too far back in, in time, you'll see that the Linux kernel won't work anymore because it can't understand the ZST compression. So if you're thinking about downgrading kernels, think about that again. I say, oh yeah, true, I need to go to XZ again, okay? So that's it, um, you're welcome to join us in this, uh, uh, this, this, this change in the make init CPIO. So ZST by default, all hashtagged out. Let's end with the image here. So there's nothing in here anymore. There's nothing there, which means ZST is gonna be default on January. But if you wanna keep rolling, right? This is one of the things you probably uh, leave it up to you manually, not in scripts or anything like that. This is your decision and you intervene manually. Yes. All right, enjoy.